Hey guys, Steve Jabber here. So in this video, we're going to talk about the top three dating apps. And I've chosen dating apps where you stand the maximum chance of actually hooking up with a girl for the minimum possible cost. Now to make that happen, there's a free trial link in the description below this video. If you use this link on all the dating apps, you'll be able to sign up for free and get discounts on the various tokens and credits and account upgrades as you come across them. So we'll start with number three, local MILF selfies. You can probably tell what this dating Dating site is all about from the actual name. So this is for guys that are under 40 and who like cougars or MILFs. On this dating site there are about 3 million members, the majority of them are women, and these girls are looking for younger guys or cubs. Now, if you're a young guy and you like cougars and MILFs, this site is going to be ideal for you. The women are actually quite thirsty <gasps> on this site. That's because the male to female ratio is about 70% women and about 30% guys. So the girls actually chase the guys on this site. Now what can you get for free on local mill selfies. Well, you can sign up, create your profile, add your pictures and your text, and start favoriting or winking at the cougars. Because they're so thirsty, when you do this, you will start to get messages in your inbox. This site is basically for guys that are normal looking. You don't have to be a chad or a plus in looks. You'll be fine if you're a five or a six in looks and you just have some good photos. It's actually cheaper to upgrade your account on local mill selfies. So why is this a good free dating app? Well, you can do most things for free. You can basically line up dates for free. All you can't do is actually message the girls. Now, if you contrast that with Tinder, where there are eight times more guys than women, and the average guy in there is much more attractive than they are on local MILF selfish, you can see your probability of hooking up with a girl for a low cost is much lower on an app like Tinder, even though it says it's free, which it isn't. Now, number two on our list of best free dating apps is Ashley Madison, and this is a dating site for everybody. Now, back in the day when Ashley Madison started off, you probably know it as an infidelity site. Women looking to have indiscretions or affairs. Things have moved on since then and it caters for everything in between. So if you're a younger guy, again, looking for a cougar or a MILF, you'll find that on Ashley Madison. And if you're an older guy looking for a very attractive younger women, there are plenty of gorgeous women on Ashley Madison too. And it basically has everything in between. So why is this a good free dating app? Well, you can do, once again, most things. You can line up dates on the dating app, favorite, wink at the girls, and get them to message you first without paying for an upgraded account. When you do upgrade your account, you're paying to get access to the messaging system so you can actually arrange dates. But you can do virtually all of that, all the preamble for the date before actually upgrading. So use the free trial link in the description below, put your email in and you'll be able to start arranging dates, favoriting girls and so on. Very quickly, it takes about a day to get your profile approved. Now this dating app is a little bit more expensive than local mill selfies to upgrade, but the quality of women is higher and there is a much broader range of women on this dating site. Also, there are 10 million members as opposed to the three or four million on local MILF selfies. And the number one free dating app is Adult Friend Finder. So why is this number one? Well, this gets you the best bang for your buck, the highest probability of meeting and hooking up with a girl of all the dating apps we've talked about, and certainly way, way higher than what you would find on Tinder. So some basic facts about Adult Friend Finder. 65 million members, 25 million active members per month, a ratio of at least 50-50 in most US states, and in some of the states there are 60% women and only 40% guys. Now, unlike Tinder, the guys are not heroes with a big strong jawline, eight plus in looks, and you're not filtered out by the Denied. algorithm. Basically, Adult Friend Finder is for normal people that just want to hook up. Now, when a girl signs up to this dating app, she knows exactly what she's going to get. She knows she's looking to hook up. So if you send her a message, and within a few messages you're looking to go out for a date and to take things further, she's not going to be shocked. You're not going to experience all the ghosting and flaking that you do on Tinder. That's if you even get a message at all. So although Tinder purports to be free, it actually isn't. And when you work out the cost on a pro rata basis, so to speak, in terms of the actual number of messages it takes to get a girl out and how long it takes and how expensive it is, Adult Friend Finder is number one. And if you do decide to upgrade your account, you'll notice there's a discount applied using that link. It's actually very inexpensive to upgrade on Adult Friend Finder, once again cheaper than a Tinder boost. So try these dating apps for free, use the link in the description below and I'll see you guys in the next video.